Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome to Reach Design 16. So this is where I post about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle every single week. Before we get started on this extra, new extra lip sense, uh color with satin matte gloss, uh, please like this video and please hit the subscribe button. So let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, so I wanted to hop on and do the brand new extra lip sense color. It is a mid-size mini uh, lip sense, which means it's cheaper. This one is from the new collection um, Ultra Intense collection or Intense Ultra, I can't remember, um, but I got one of them. They have three uh, three lip senses, and then it comes with a satin matte, and it's new formulated, but I have never tried it, and a lot of people top it with glossy gloss and then blot it off. If you don't know what lip sense is, lip sense is a liquid lip color that is equal up to three tubes three three or four tubes of regular lip sense. It is uh, gluten free, made in the US, vegan free, cruelty free, it's not to sit on any animals, doesn't have any animal products in it. It lasts from four to 18 hours. Um, it is smudge proof, kiss proof, and water resistant. It is amazing. When I tried it the first time, it was a game changer because I would have, like, I would go to the drugstore and buy regular lip scents and it would just be a mess, like horrible mess. And like, I would have to keep reapplying it after I ate. The only thing I do when I go to eat, before I eat, I gloss. Um, so, yeah. And also, if you're starting out with a, a starter kit, um, a regular starter kit is $55, but the mid-size is like 19, and then um, the gloss gloss is 20. The gloss gloss is a must. So I'm going to do it a different way, but you can order this one, but a lot of people, that I've been researching and a lot of my friends say that putting the glossy gloss on, excuse me, the gloss gloss on first um, and then blotting it off and putting the satin matte gloss over top um, makes it last longer. Or you could just do the glossy gloss. I forgot one thing, so hold that down. Okay, before you apply the lip sense, you want to take a damp rag and just kind of go over top of your lips to make sure there's no food and no makeup on top because you don't want to put it on and then have it crack and mess up. So, um, now I'm just going to apply it to dry it. And this stuff does not come off for anything. Like it says on I've drink, I've drinking, drinking, drunk. <laughs> I can't even talk right. I drink coffee all the time. I eat. I go throughout my day. I I work out everything, and it does not budge at all. So, um, but you always want to shake the tube and if you hear that clicking doesn't matter if it's a brand new color and you haven't opened it up you want to shake it up um every single time even if it's new or not because if you hear that clicking lightly there's a machine going on in my garage um so if you hear that loud noise that's what that is so, if you, you hear that clicking? So you want to do it for about 30 seconds. And then it's actually a bead mixing up the color. So when you apply the three thin layers, 
you want to go in the same direction you start with. Now, when you apply the glossy gloss or the satin matte gloss, you don't have to do it in the same direction. So, I already shook a little bit off camera. Okay, so here I go. This is sealed. Do you see that? Sealed. Nothing. So this is called extra. And before each layer, you want to make sure your lips are dry and clean, but you want to wipe off all of the excess that you have on the wand. So here I go. Here's layer one. Okay, and you don't want to go back and forth because you're just smearing it. And your lips cannot touch um, when you're applying this. So. And you can go back in and touch up or you think it needs to be touched up. Okay, it doesn't have to be perfect at all. So it takes about five to 10 seconds to dry. Oh, it's a little sticky. Layer two, you want to make sure it's fully dry. So, it's fully dry now. So here's layer two. want to make sure you get that water line. Okay. This is a matte color. Got it on our teeth, don't do that. Okay. So I left it alone. So it's not gonna be perfect. But I'm gonna let it dry and do layer three. Yeah. 
it's not quite dry yet. So, I'll go back in. Okay, I'm going to show you a trick. So, I would use an oops remover at this point because I messed up right here, but it doesn't look bad. I need to practice more. So, I cannot find my oops remover. Still sticky. You want to make sure it's dry. See the code. Okay, this is clear. Do you see how my wand is clear? And you just apply it. Do you see nothing on the wand that's from old makeup? I like it even though I messed up a little bit. I really like it. Now I'm going to take the same towel in a different spot and you want to rub your lip together to seal in the glass of glass. And sometimes I go around to make sure that it's in there. So now I'm going to blot it off. Okay. And I'm going to open the new satin matte um, glass. It's clear like a cream. Oh yeah, this, you can totally tell, it made it more matte. Totally. I should show you the difference or make another video. And I bet you can use these on other, um, Rub them together, and there you have a matte lip. This is so pretty. I'm so glad I showed this. Even though I messed up a little bit on camera, it still works. I'm still learning. I'm still practicing after a while, I think. But learning new stuff and showing you guys is what I'm all about. So... I, once I get my hair done and stuff, it will probably look really good. So, I'm going to finish up here and come back with the end result for you guys. Okay, so I'm back with the extra lip with the satin matte gloss. And 
It is amazing. I'm so glad I showed it on camera. Yes, I did mess up a little bit, but practice makes perfect, right? So I might come back with another updated video, but I wanted to show you guys. I, like, I'm obsessed with this color. Like, it's a perfect neutral red. It's not like a red, but it has a red tint to it. But I will put down my link down in the description box so that you can purchase this and I'll tell you everything I used. So, please like this video and please hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell so that you will be notified every time I post a new video first come first serve. Thanks for watching.